The varieties of grass we use in our gardens is changing a lot in Australia. Driven by a drying climate, we're looking for lawns that can only survive a long dry summer, but actually thrive in these conditions. Now the new generation grasses include varieties we've never really heard of before, like Empire Zoysia grass. And then there's the new generation of buffalo grasses like Palmetto, and this one called Sapphire. This Australian bred turf grass variety is an absolute hit in America, where in Texas and Florida it is the number one specified turf grass variety. And it's because it's so soft and lush and green, it's the perfect playing platform for children and even pets, or maybe just laying out in the sun enjoying a lovely soft green grass. In recent research, Sapphire rated number one performing turf in shady situations, as well as wear tolerance and recovery, retaining winter colour and even herbicide tolerance. Maintaining a lawn can be a bit of a bugbear for some people. That is, of course, unless you're obsessive compulsive. Then it's sort of fun in a strange way, I don't know. But look, if you're not into maintaining it, well, you don't have to worry if you've got a turf grass like sapphire or palmetto. These modern buffalo turf grass varieties require a lot less maintenance to look fantastic all year round. But when they're ready to be mowed, you don't need an incredibly expensive mower. You just need a quality buffalo mower that's powerful and at the same time gentle on the environment. This one's called a buffalo buck mower and it's from Honda. And believe me, it is an absolute beauty. It's four strokes, so it isn't noisy like the old fashioned two strokes and it isn't difficult to maintain like old fashioned mowers. And most importantly, it starts like a dream. Now, if you struggle with weeds in your lawn, don't worry, most people do, but there are ways to control them. A regular mow once a week is gonna keep your lawn down nice and tight. It also cuts out all the weeds, but most importantly, if you're mowing once a week, you end up with that bowling green effect, an absolutely beautiful showpiece lawn. The last thing you need to worry about is fertilising your lawn all the time. And the good news with a roll-on sapphire lawn is once it's initially established, well, it doesn't require a huge amount of feed. In fact, once it gets going, you only feed it once every three months, the start of every season. And that will leave it looking lush green and the best looking lawn in the street.